Hey guys, Buttercup's Reef here. We're going to do an unboxing of a mini UV sterilizer bot for the BioCube by Coral Life. This cost me $59.99 at Foster's and Smith. So oh, let's see what we've got here. It comes with an adapter. Let's see how that works. It says it fits 14 29 gallon HQI. Alright, the whole point is to kill free floating algae parasites, harmful bacteria. I'm getting this uh, because I've been trying to get over a green hair algae outbreak and I've gotten it to where it's almost completely gone but it keeps like, having very small amounts of growth. So I'm hoping that this will take care of it so I can get my tank back up and going. Let's see what the box looks like. Looks pretty simple. Alright, let's open it up. Coupons, of course. Little manual. And here's all the pieces. Let's see what we have. That's it guys, that's what we've got. If you take off the cover, these are the UV lights on the inside. I found this interesting, it says it works optimally at 100 to 200 GPH. So this is where we're going to put it in the tank. And these come with it in order to install it. So I ran into a little issue with the BioCube adapter, which is this one. This is the universal adapter. Is that the side that attaches to my tank attaches well, but then the other side does not fit onto the UV light. Kind of annoying. Uh, but if you turn it around the other way, it'll fit onto the UV light, but not onto my BioCube. So I have an older BioCube. Maybe they've changed the diameter a little bit. I highly doubt it. Um, so what I found to fix it. So I'm going to use the adapter. You can put the adapter in to the bio cube and then it'll fit in just well and the water should flow. The indicator light, I'm going to have it coming out of the back of the tank so you can make sure it's working. Here it is up and running. All in all, you can see that there's a slight leak around where it didn't fit exactly. Not 100% happy about that. Uh, you can see the indicator light is on. So. I'm kind of on the wall with this one. The thing is, it's hard to find something that fits in the small space of the bio cube. It better work well to have a small leak like that, and not to have the adapters fit perfectly. And I did try to put the tubings in to try and attach it that way, but it was too tall for the compartment. So we'll see. If it works great, then it's worth it. If it doesn't, well then it's not. I'll leave a comment and let you guys know. Thanks, guys.